Bag with the Remus. These boys are my sons like Phoenix. My city is the influencer family is pumped to announce our NIL suite, a new offering that will begin with a product feature called Data Services that will empower head coaches and their staffs to recruit compliantly around NIL while giving student athletes the metrics around social media that will produce a content strategy to maximize their brand building in the NIL era. And today we're excited to announce that influencer partner Marquette Basketball is the first college basketball program in America to add this impactful offering to their existing influencer partnership. And now we're joined by head coach Wojo from Marquette Men's Basketball. And coach, I've had the pleasure of getting to know you over the past couple years as we built a partnership between your program and Influencer. And I've watched you lead athletically, academically, in ways of excellence that stand apart from most programs in America. And I've also seen you learn more about social media, admittedly not being a social media expert, and invest more into the brands on social media of your student athletes. So I just gotta ask, why Influencer and why be the first to add this new offering from Influencer? Well, I think it's a critical part of the student athlete experience and their development uh, as people, uh, as players, and then ultimately uh, their own brand. And our partnership with Influencer uh, gives us a platform, uh, gives us information to help educate our guys, but also uh, promote our guys um, individually and collectively that will benefit them uh, in the short term and the long term. And so uh, with the NLI uh, coming down the pike, we felt like it was incredibly important uh, to be proactive uh, and get our program ahead of the curve, educate our guys, and then execute the plan. No doubt about it, coach. And talking about that word brand, when I hear your name, Wojo. I think of you as a player and a coach, and I think right away, intensity. That's what you're known for. And when you see the Nike logo or any logo of a brand you admire, you have a specific thought right away. What do you want people to think when they see that Marquette men's basketball logo? Well, when they see the Marquette men's basketball logo, the first thing I want them to think of is family and all the things that come into mind when you think of a, a strong family. There's a great tradition uh, here at Marquette that has stretched decades upon decades. And we really believe that we stand on the shoulders of giants. Uh, certainly there's been outstanding coaches uh, and you know many, many great players here. And as the caretaker of that program, we wanna make sure that we are a family oriented group uh, that is pursuing excellence through our competitive spirit, our toughness, and our selflessness. No doubt, Coach. And when you look at the investment you're making into brand building, it's surely something that you can sell to the recruit when he is considering your program. And this is something that we've built our entire business off of with more than 700 college team partners across the country. And you've been a big part of that but you're also an early adopter, not only of Influencer, but now the NIL suite data services offering in being able to package up this communication to the prospective student athlete. We, we've done this a little bit already, right? We did it with Dawson Garcia when he visited Marquette to look at your program and you wanted to show him how you're gonna help him build his brand. So now that we're doing this together, how does it impact future recruiting and exactly what you're presenting to a recruit? when they're considering your program? Well, I think it'll have a huge impact. And, and, you know, if you think of recruiting in general as a pie, you know, the pie just got bigger. And the ability to build your individual brand while you're representing the name on the front of the jersey is going to be something uh, that I think every recruit uh, will want an answer to uh, because uh, with the name, image, and likeness, and the possibilities and the potential uh, to create not only a brand, but ulti ultimately revenue through their social media presence um, is something that uh, I think is going to be 
a conversation that we have with every kid that we recruit uh, here at Marquette and our ability to be proactive and, and continue the partnership with Influencer and take it really to the next level was a, I think, the perfect natural prog progression. So you say take it to the next level and coach, that's exactly why we did the work to roll out this new NIL suite on top of our current influencer offering. You've had influencer for a while. You're now one of 10 teams that are the first to pilot our NIL suite data services offering. And what I really think is interesting is some of the things that data services will help you be able to do with recruiting are things we've already been doing a little bit of with recruits like Dawson Garcia, who visited your campus amongst others, ended up signing with you. And you showed Dawson how you're gonna help him build his brand at Marquette. You even gave him a roadmap of the brand building opportunity from a metric standpoint, based on historical evidence from past athletes that have come through your program and built big brands on social media. This is what we're gonna be doing together with you more often with your coaching staff and your student athletes. So just talk about, um, how this investment plays into the communication you're going to be delivering to recruits as they come to evaluate the Marquette men's basketball program? Well, I think it's, it's huge. I think one, it shows a university wide and administrative commitment to our men's basketball program, where any resource that is going to serve our players who, who are the most important people in our program our university is committed to giving them the best possible experience in every way so they can maximize who they are, not just as players, uh, but as people, as students, and now as brands. And so uh, our partnership with Influencer and being one of the first uh, to really uh, take off and take it to the next level in terms of individual brand building and program brand building, uh, I think gives us uh, a leg up on our competition because we, we are and we do have a plan to maximize our players' individual brands in addition to helping them develop and shape that brand and to be able to tell their story uh, to the world in a way where people and potentially companies are going to want them to be spokespeople for what they, they do. Coach, when you look at the NIL recommendations, and of course that's what they are at this point, recommendations that will be debated about for months to come before they become finalized as regulations, they can put coaching staffs and programs in a tough spot when it comes to what you're allowed to be involved in around NIL and your student athletes' use of their NIL. And so I, I wanna talk about how this investment into influencers NIL suite data services offering is giving you the ability to lean into NIL in a way that helps you know you'll be compliant in how you recruit without any fear around violating any NIL regulations because we don't even know what those regulations are yet. So talk about how you're leaning in to NIL, especially in the recruiting process when it comes to this additional investment with Influencer? Well, we base all our decisions on facts. And the fact is what exactly the NIL looks like in the eyes of the NCAA and how, it's, how, it, is, how it works uh, is unclear. Um, however, what is clear is that uh, it is important, uh, as you say, to, to be compliant, uh, but also build the individual brands of our players. And we feel like uh, as there is more clarity to what the NCAA is going to ultimately decide that social media and uh, player social media footprint is going to be something that they can potentially benefit off of. I, I think there's no question uh, that the investment in that is going to reap huge dividends for our program and most importantly, our players. And when you talk to your players about social media, what do you tell them, coach? Well, we want our players to embr embrace social media. I mean, the fact of the matter is, it is the way that their generation communicates. And it has tremendous power. 
It has tremendous power to tell a story. And so we try to educate our guys on the appropriate ways to shape their story and to tell their story where it's both authentic and compelling uh, to the people who follow them. Coach, I gotta tell you, I know you say that social media is not your biggest expertise, but watching you invest in yourself, your coaching staff, your student athletes over the past couple of years throughout our partnership between Influencer and Marquette has been really encouraging because as a young head coach, you are ahead of the curve in how you're powering the brand building of your student athletes. And uh, that's what we're passionate about at Influencer. We're here to serve storytellers. Those storytellers are student athletes such as yours and teams like Marquette. And we're just so excited about taking our partnership between Influencer and Marquette men's basketball to the next level. No, we appreciate it, Jim. And we believe in Influencer and your company and your team. Uh, our partnership uh, has been a great one. It has helped us grow our program. Our players and our student athletes uh, have embraced it at an incredibly high level. And it's benefited them in ways uh, that they can see now and in ways that they'll see when they're when they're finished their college career so uh, we appreciate your guidance and your support and being being a part of our team here at marquette it's been absolutely awesome